All right, welcome back in this morning. We are just approaching 11 minutes after the top of the hour and with first alert Doppler radar. We're looking at drying conditions, especially west of Toledo where skies are clear at just a few flurries between now and about seven o'clock. So the next 60 minutes, we'll see the last of a few flurries that will taper off. Now today, February 2nd, Secretly, I love this day, right? Where we uh, have hope that we're halfway through winter and we can look toward Punxsutawney Phil for at least a little folklore, right? And if Punxsutawney Phil sees his shadow, six more weeks of winter, no shadow will mean early spring. And either way you look at it, it marks the halfway point. We're halfway through winter with half of it still to go. Your first alert forecast, though, that's what really matters to you. Got to pay close attention to this because this weekend and early next week, we're going to get hit with an Arctic outbreak. The coldest weather, no doubt, of the winter season is headed our way through the weekend and next week. It is going to be blitzing out of Canada into the northern uh, plains and eventually into our area through the course of the weekend. Here's what you can expect this morning. Temperature wise generally in the upper teens and low 20s. Teens extending back toward the western side of the viewing area. And you can pretty much tell where the skies have cleared out west of Toledo. It's colder where we have the cloud cover east of Toledo. We're still in the low to mid 20s, but all areas should be turning colder with sunshine returning at least partly sunny skies today. One area where we still will see some cloud cover east of Toledo drifting off the Lake Erie shores. It will enhance some cloud cover east of I-75, but overall partly sunny skies. Cool, brisk breeze will be expected today. We'll be mostly clear tonight. Lows tonight down into the teens and as we go into tomorrow, bright sunshine on Wednesday. Really look forward to this. I'm going to call tomorrow the pick day of the week. Should be brilliant and sunny. Maybe a good chance to scrub the salt off the car. Good day for a car wash on Wednesday with the sunshine. It's going to be brilliant. Today, pretty decent looking day. Right around the low 30s will be brisk and chilly with the breeze, though. Still keeping our wind chills back in the teens and 20s. Fairly quiet weather. Today, brighter skies begin to arrive. Sunshine should be pretty brilliant Wednesday. Low 30s. Next storm system arrives late Thursday into Friday morning. That will come in in the form of rain Thursday evening and Thursday night, but a pretty strong cold front. This at least has my attention into Friday morning. It could bring some minor snow accumulations, but difficult travel could be possible Friday morning with some snow and wind. We tumble back to 22 for the high Friday. That's just the first push of cooler air. First alert days into the weekend, Saturday and Sunday and through early next week and check out that Arctic chill. We're going to see temperatures drop through the weekend and by Sunday, frigid cold. The chance of accumulating snow may return on Sunday, so we'll have a close eye on that one for Super Bowl Sunday. And by early next week, Monday, lows expected to be below zero for the first time this season. Highs for a couple days could only be in the upper single digits and wind chills likely to be sub zero several days early next week.